Many flight attendants have been coming to the Seniority Integration Committee to ask us to define what percentile ranking and relative seniority means. It's an important concept, one that helps us to assess what our system bidding power is. A flight attendant's relative seniority is their individual placement on the seniority list and how it compares to the other Delta flight attendants. Betty, you know you're right. We have gotten quite a number of emails from flight attendants who have inquired uh, in reference to relative seniority and percentile ranking and maybe a little confusion as to what that term means. Uh, we haven't used it that much in the past, but it is very important to understand what it means. Uh, let me give you an example. If you had, uh, say, take a group of 1,000 flight attendants and uh, say you're number 250 on the list, uh, that person would be uh, ranked at 25% um, on the percentile ranking. And then say you take another person and they're uh, 660 out of the 1,000. They would rank in the 66th percentile. So in those two examples, what you do is take uh, uh, the, the person. Uh, the first example was 250 and divide it by 1,000. They come up uh, with the 25%. Then the same thing with the other one, 660, divide it by the, the whole number, which is 1,000, and they come up in the 66th percentile. Patty, what's your number right now on the seniority list with Delta? Presently, it's 969. Ooh, area code. All right, I like that. Let's see, 969, and we've got 13,595 on our current list, and that comes up to 7.12. So that means that your percentile ranking is 7.12 on the pre-merge list. You know and I know that when we put the two lists together and we merge them, uh, you'll lose your area code status, and your number will get bigger, and my number will get bigger. But Relatively speaking, um, we have to go back and look at the percentile ranking or the relative seniority ranking. And what you can do is now take your new number, divide it by the new combined total number of flight attendants on the new list, and that'll give you your ranking uh, based on the new list. And then you can compare it with the other. So when we see these new numbers, we don't need to get a false impression. Right. on how it really will affect our, our bidding seniority. Correct. Because if our percentile rankings change not at all or only slightly, then that means that there will be a neutral effect on our bidding. We also have to remember that we are going to have additional flying proportionately with whatever comes out of the merging of the Delta and the Northwest networks. That's true, yes. One thing also to keep in mind is that our base percentile ranking, our relative seniority, is important to each of us. The bottom line for all of us is that our base seniority really is what drives our schedules. So well said.